Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. Want to tell them what we're doing today, Bob? Huh? Where are we? Huh? We at camp. May or may not have just drove down the camp road with Dad. Um, we're spending the day at camp with mostly Kyle's family, but just some friends as well. Um, yeah, it's supposed to be like 80 something degrees out today, so we kind of wore like our workout clothes. We're gonna go for a good walk this morning and then just hang out by the water all day. So, I'm excited. Oh, and we're also, we're having lobster later, which I am so excited about. If you guys have never had Maine lobster, it is life-changing. I tried to have lobster somewhere else. It was somewhere in New England. It might've been in Mass, and it was like, not very good. Also, I got my hair chopped, and I'll show you guys that at some point in the vlog, but I'm gonna go say hi to everybody. I look like I got electrocuted. You wanna put your socks on? Good morning guys. We are about to go for a walk. Um, Get some socks, buddy. Last night... No. No. Okay, well let's just be honest. No. No. Kyle and I showered together. And somehow, like... Somehow. My hair got wet in the shower. And um, so I had, to, I had to wash it. No, I, I ended up having to wash my hair and I didn't plan on it. So then I went to bed with my hair soaking wet. So um, this is the result. It literally, like, whoa, what is happening? Um, okay, so we're going to go for a walk. I wanted to show you guys how I put on the carrier, though, because I get so many questions on how. Where is the carrier? Um, yeah, but we're about to go for a walk. If we have the carrier, I'll, I'll show you guys how I put it on. Hi. Hi. <laughs> All right, Knox, we're not going to go for a walk until you let me put your socks on. Okay, guys, so this is the carrier that I get so many questions on. I will link it down below. I highly recommend it. I have nothing bad to say about it. Um, but it has like a little clip back here, so that clips. And then it has these shoulder straps. So it's a lot easier than a lot of the wraps because I know that those can be kind of like overwhelming figuring how, like, how to wrap them. But this one's actually really easy. <laughs> guys I just got ready for the day um we got back from our walk and we just kind of like had lunch and played outside and um had like a chill rest of our morning and then Nox just went down for a nap Al actually just woke up I fed her and I like got ready so I curled my hair for the first time um but since I slept on it like my part and like every all my texture like I don't know it's just kind of weird so I think it will look even better when I like blow dry it and then curl it um but yeah I'm really happy with it I think it's cute and like fresh and fun for summer I have a few things I want to like share with you guys I want to um, open up some toy boxes that we got from Love Every for the kids and I want to paint my nails I need to edit a video I'm like always making the most of nap time. So I want to show you guys what I'm wearing really quick. Um, if I can find an exact link for it down below, I will link it, but otherwise I'll link things similar um, because I got it at TJ Maxx. So it's one of those things like you never know if your TJ's is gonna have it. This is what I'm wearing. It's like a little pantsuit. It's so cute, so comfortable. I love the print and like the colors and everything. It's just kind of like boho-y. And I like that it has this little like scrunchy ordeal underneath because I'm actually not even wearing a bra. So. That's amazing, but sis is fussing, so I gotta go get her. Ah! 
<laughs> you happy girl? All right, so I have three boxes that I need to open up um, from Love Every. So, so they are a toy company and they make specialized kits for like they call them play kits for um, like each age and stage. So in these boxes, I have the Play Gym, which I'm really excited to unbox and put together for her. Um, and then I also have the 25 to 27 month Play Kit and the 22 to 24 month Play Kit. So I'm going to open up the 25 to 27 one first because we already actually took some of the toys out of this. In this box, we have already taken out this little play sink and it's outside right now. Knox loves it. He's obsessed with it. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you probably saw that, but this is my favorite thing that came in this box. The other thing that we have already taken out is this little toy here. So it comes with a bunch of like little wooden pieces, a little bag to put them in, and then it's almost like Connect Four, but it's like color coded and stuff. So it's really cute, and Knox has also been loving that. So the other stuff that is in here, let's see. So these are Let's Map It Out routine cards. So that's kind of cool. These are like little routine cards. So this one says, wash your hands, sing a song, whoops, snack time. Um, I'm not sure quite how they recommend using these, but they always send you a book in each box that um, gives you different ideas and recommendations on how to use each toy. I feel like these could help uh, make your day maybe go a little bit smoother or something like that, depending on how they recommend using them. Bless you, sissy. Yeah, I just love how like simple their toys are and how they just allow your child to like learn and explore kind of on their own. The next thing in here I see is this little book. What is this? It says Anywhere Art Kit. Oh, this is fun. Okay, how cute is this? These are washable paint sticks. Okay, these are really cool. Knox will love this. So it comes with some paper and then these little paint sticks and it zips and closes. So this would be a great thing to travel with, especially if you have to wait in like a doctor's office or something. Uh, maybe this would be a good thing to pack in your diaper bag and bring along with you. Also in here is a making muffins book. Okay, that's adorable. One bowl of blueberries, juice, and tart. This is really cute. I love their books. The other books that they've sent have become some of our favorites. This one looks so cute. This is felt flowers in a row. So they send you this little wooden block. It's like a little Velcro bundle of flowers. And then you like can plant it. Knox will also just love this but you can plant them in this little wooden thing Oops. okay the last thing in this box is this double side sunny day puzzle oh this is cool so it's like a little puzzle board um and then you get all of these different pieces and it's double sided with different things on each side and yeah you can put the puzzle together with these different shapes next is the 22 to 23 month box First thing in here I see is this drawstring bag and it has like lions, horses, pigs, dogs, monkeys, cats, <laughs> a bunch of random animals on it. Oh my gosh, Knox is going to love this. So there's little like fake, obviously fake, they're like toy animals, um, but they look really real, which one of our friends has animals like that and Knox was like fascinated with them. Um, they also come with these Montessori animal match. So it's like a matching game. So you put out the lion uh, little play card, which these are again wooden, and then you have them match them up with the little animal toy. So that is really cute. And I love this little bag. This would be a great one to throw in the car um, or throw in your diaper bag just to kind of have in case you are going to be waiting somewhere or something like that. But that is an adorable toy. He will love that. So the next thing in here is the buckle barrel. So it's like this barrel of different buckles and things. So this is definitely like a sensory toy. Um, there's all different types of buckles that they can kind of figure out and do. This one, again, great car toy, something that they can play with in their car seat. Next is puzzles to go box. So this is like a little oh cute so we haven't really gotten into like large puzzles or anything but how cute are these little mini they're just like two piece puzzles so that is a great start to doing puzzles they're all like different animals and you have to match them up okay this is adorable um so this is little quinn and it's this little doll which again Knox is going to love he loves dolls this one is so sweet 
honestly it looks like a doll that was like handmade or something uh it's really really cute and then next in here is the mosaic is the mosaic button board um so it looks like this and then so apparently you set it up like this and it has a bunch of different pieces for you to put in like the slots almost like they click in or something so that looks really fun again a sensory toy that i think nox will really enjoy next in here is chunky wooden jigsaw puzzles so it comes with four pieces i guess you can just click them all different ways okay this looks really cute so this is a large nesting stacking drip drop cups okay and then also in here are these little tweezers with these little felt stars <laughs> Just so creative. This is so fun. Noxwell love figuring out these tweezers and like pulling these out. But these little cups are like stacking cups. Um, but some of them actually have holes in the bottom. So they'd be great like tubby toys or toys to play with outside um, in like a little pool or something. So next in here I see two books. This one is B gets a checkup. That little girl is so adorable. It kind of like explains what happens at a checkup, which... Um, I feel like it's good to talk to your child about so they you know feel like it's normal and don't feel like scared when they go there and then this one is Graham turns two so it's like a little birthday party um, book Knox is gonna go crazy over this this is a carry along kit so I have no idea what's in here but just the box itself he's going to love okay cute also comes with these little stickers oh my gosh okay so that is what is in the two boxes I feel like those boxes were really full of like really good toys. So the next box is the um, Play Jam, which I mentioned in a video a while ago, like months and months ago. But uh, she wasn't here yet, and I was like, I don't want to set it up right now if you know we're not going to use it for a while. But now I think she will definitely lay and play on this. So this is what it looks like, and I am just going to go ahead and set it up. <music> it looks guys it's so cute it actually came with two little mirrors to slide in um back there as well but like this is just adorable i'll show you guys a close-up in a second but this is a new piece that they actually just came out with for your play gym which is so cute it's got different um things hanging from it that make different sounds and have different textures and it can hook on so this is the little canopy that kind of turns it into more of like a tent instead of a play gym. But yeah, I'm just going to set these aside and save those for later. This is just adorable. I love all the different patterns and textures and all like the little toys that they have on it. So cute and fun for them to explore. Okay, so it's laundry day, so we don't have anything on our bed. It's <laughs> Sis is right up here. I'm actually probably going to bring her down here with me. Come here. So I wanted to unbox just a couple of things for you guys. In a recent vlog, I mentioned Alyssa's Clay Co. And she makes like these adorable handmade clay earrings. Um, and she just sent me another pair and they're the cutest thing. Actually, I could probably wear them with what I have on today as like a little accent. So these are the ones she sent me. They're like this really light kind of turquoisey bluish gray color. They're so pretty. I love the shape of them and just like how unique they are thank you so much to her i have a little collection of her earrings going and yeah they're just really really cute and well made and then next i received a pr package from kimmy bear so first they sent this pj set for Knox. these pajamas guys this was the first thing i pulled out of the box and i was like blown away by the quality like so stretchy i wish you guys could feel this they're so soft and like a nice well-made thick material they're really really cute i like just this random um like abstract print that's on them and the colors they're like blue and um, mustard yellow and white so the pants came with a matching shirt so i just think these are so cute and again just oh my gosh i love the quality of these and i will absolutely be checking out their site for more pajamas and then the rest is for sis 
So the first outfit they sent is this little two-piece set. Um, it comes with this cute little ribbed and buttoned down little like peplum top. And then these little, are these called bloomers or am I making that up? But it's like a little diaper cover pretty much is all it covers. But these are like high-waisted. So it comes as a little outfit like that. I think that is adorable. This is adorable. This is definitely for next summer. I think this was like 12 to 18 months or something. But first it comes with this little crop top and it's got like these little ruffle shoulders. So cute. And I love the little like white star print. Um, and with this comes this little high-low ruffled skirt. I can't. With little black sandals or like gold gladiator sandals or something. Oh my word. I just think that is adorable. And again, I love the star print because that is like super trendy right now. Next, I love this. I love the color. It's like a bluish gray. It's like a little one-piece outfit, but it's got like the smock top with the little bow tie um, shoulders. I love little outfits like this because they're just like easy but still adorable and um, comfy to wear and this is kind of like that like linen material that's like crinkly and I really like that I like that it looks like I don't know like a, it's like a natural looking fabric and then the last thing they sent us is another rib set so it comes with this little peplum top and it's like a gray um, soft cottony material and then it comes with these little shorts <laughs> which are just so cute again they're like little bloomers but as a little set I think that is just adorable so thank you to them for sending these to me. I think those clothes are so, so cute and I will definitely be checking out their site for more. And then next I wanted to share with you guys my BoxyCharm. So BoxyCharm is $25 a month. You get five full-size products and it's usually worth like $100 to $150 in the box. Like that's the value of the products in your box. So I love getting BoxyCharm. It's like a little treat every month and I get really excited when it shows up on my doorstep. I do have a link um, with them to get you $5 off your first box. So I will leave that down below. You always receive a little card with the original price of all the products on there. Uh, but the first thing in here I see is this Lamar Cosmetics. What is this? Birthday Suit Lip Gloss. This is originally $15. It's like a really pretty pink color. It looks like it definitely has some sparkly um, like shimmer in it. It's got like some orangey kind of pinkish tones in it. I often will give lip glosses to my mom because she's like the lip gloss queen. I swear she like collects lip gloss. She doesn't mind when there's a little bit of glitter in it. I like more like matte like glosses. Uh, yeah, I don't know if that's making any sense, but I may offer this to my mama. Next thing in here is the Studio Makeup Cream Eyeshadow. Retails for $25. I really like the packaging. It's like nice and chic. Um, this looks really pretty. Let's do a little swatch. Ooh. It's like shimmery, but it's not like super chunky, chunky glitter that you couldn't wear on a daily basis if you wanted to. And when you blend it out, it actually shears out quite a bit. If you wanted just like a little bit of shimmer, you could just tap a little on your lid and I think it would be really pretty. Next in here is the Next Gen Blender Set. So it comes with two little beauty blenders and it comes with like two different shapes, which I really like. And they're also like pink and white marbles. So they're really, really cute. These retail for $22. So yeah, I'm excited to try these. I'm always open to trying new beauty blenders and things because I use a beauty blender every single day. Um, well, I don't use a beauty blender. I use the Real Techniques one, but I'm always open to trying new ones. Next in here is the Clean Skin Club Vitamin C Brightening Booster. Watermelon, green tea, pineapple. Okay, yum. Watermelon, green tea, and pineapple are like three of my favorite things, so I'm excited already. This retails for $49.95, very expensive. Um, it says a powerful mix of pineapple, watermelon, and green tea extracts come together to create an ultimate all-in-one serum. This vitamin C brightening booster brightens the complexion for glowy skin, protects against UV damage, and helps reduce eventual signs of aging. So, hello, like, I feel like everyone needs this. Ooh, the packaging's pretty. It comes in this, like, glass packaging. It feels very nice, very expensive. Uh, I hope it smells like all of these things. Mmm. It smells mostly like a green tea which I really like because it smells very very fresh like it would be refreshing to put on your face I love serums I've gotten really into serums um, in the past like year or so especially through like BoxyCharm because we always receive like products like this that I would never buy myself because I just wouldn't even know where to start and yeah I just love trying out new serums and like improving my skin and then lastly in here I see an eyeshadow palette this is the Ace Beauty Bronzed in Paradise palette this retails for $30 so already I feel like I'm going to love these colors oh, wait why did I 
Bronze in Paradise. I should have assumed this was a bronzer palette, but I was thinking it was eyeshadow for some reason. This is beautiful. I will absolutely use this. So it is this bronzer palette. It has some warmer tones, some cooler tones. Um, this is really, really great, especially recently. I've been self-tanning and getting spray tans. And as you guys know, if you self-tan, you kind of are like really tan and then like you get less tan and really tan, less tan, so you're constantly like having to switch up your colors and stuff. So I feel like this would be really, really helpful in the summer when your skin tone is like always changing and stuff. Also, I love using bronzer as an eyeshadow. It's like the easiest thing to just brush them on your cheeks, brush them on your eyelid, call it good. So I feel like with this palette, I could actually create like an eye look because it has the multiple shades. So I'm so excited really impressed with that box okay so i'm actually gonna go out and make like a little snack i think i'm really quite hungry um and then i think i might paint my nails okay so for lunch i just warmed up some rice beans and chicken it's just left over from the other night i put frozen chicken in the rice cooker actually and i turned it on for two hours just like slow cooker setting or i don't know what setting it was on slow cooker something like that for two hours with hot sauce and a little bit of Greek yogurt and some like spices and stuff to make it spicy. And then I just did a can of black beans and some cilantro rice. And we've had Mexican for like three days straight. So I'm on day four eating the final leftovers of that dinner. But I am drinking my liquid IV. I have been raving about this. Mm. It's so, so good. The flavor that I'm drinking right now is the passion fruit. So these are supplements that one of these packets pretty much equals like three bottles of water or it multiplies your hydration. So you only have to drink one and it's like triple hydration. So I love these. They taste so good. They're great for breastfeeding. They're great for busy people. They're really great for anyone because everyone needs I feel like a lot of people could be better at being hydrated and drinking more water. So these are really, really helpful, but they just taste so good. It's like, I always compare it to Gatorade. I feel like that's what it tastes similar to. I love it with a bunch of ice in my Yeti. I look forward to drinking it every single day. Something else by Liquid IV that I've been loving is their energy multiplier. So this I will usually have mid-morning, like after my coffee, um, if we had a really rough night with Sis. She's actually fussing right now, hang on. But yeah, she um, had not been sleeping great, especially last week. So I was relying on these so much because I don't like to drink coffee all day. It doesn't make me feel good. And and I just like to have like my one cup of coffee in the morning. Hey, honey. Hey. Kyle's actually been taking these as well. The energy multipliers, honey, you love them, right? Yeah, they're really good. And the liquid IVs he loves too. Yeah, if you are tired or you don't like coffee and you want like a replacement or something, highly, highly recommend these. So for the hydration multipliers, there's passion fruit, lemon lime, which I think is our favorite. So good and refreshing. And then my second favorite is probably the acai berry, which is the first one we tried and where we got addicted to them. And then the passion fruit is my third favorite, but like really they're all so, so good. I'm actually just finishing up my hydration multiplier and I'm going to make a glow drink. So... Uh, I take the Organifi Glow Powder. This is my collagen powder. I've just never seen such a difference in a collagen powder before. I posted this on Instagram and multiple of you guys messaged me and was like, oh my gosh, I am so thankful you turned me on to this product. I actually ended up like reposting what you guys said because I couldn't believe how many other people there were that have just fallen in love with this product like I have. Um, whenever I love a product and I share it, I almost get nervous like, oh my gosh, what if people don't love it like I do? What if it doesn't work for them like it does for me? And this one, I've just been so relieved like anyone who's tried it and got back to me about it has said only amazing things so those of you guys who have followed me for a long time probably know that I have not always had nice nails and my nails are so long so strong I just feel like I owe it all to this and then my skin also is just so glowy and just looks so um, like nice all the time I don't have anything on right now I have like I don't even have lotion on actually I have no lotion on and you guys can see like my skin just looks so glowy it's the craziest thing to me but this stuff really works I can't recommend it enough. So um, I like to do this with half a lemon. I'm gonna make that. And I also need to take my golly gummies. I put this in the same cabinet as my liquid IV and my Organifi supplements because um, that's the only way I'm gonna remember to take my vitamins. So I'm gonna take one of these. Um, I have coupon links for all of these things down below. I affiliate with these companies because they're truly things that I take and drink every single day and I have no problem recommending them to people because I think they are wonderful. They do great things for me and my body and um, yeah, I just, I rave about them in like every vlog right now. So it's 
probably getting annoying. But so the golly gummies, I always have to keep this card because it's like there's so many benefits that I forget. Um, but appetite control and weight loss, um, lowers blood sugar levels, improves immune system. Um, infused with superfoods, pomegranate and beetroot, enriched with vitamins B9 and B12. It's safe for tooth enamel, which that's one of the things with apple cider. When you take like the shot, it can be really rough on your teeth. Uh, these all, all oh, that's not what I'm talking about. These also taste really good and smell really good too. So um, it makes them really easy to take. And I have to hide them from Kyle, which now he knows where they are. Honey buns. Yeah, I already had a couple. Kyle. They're for me too. They're yes, good. but only take one a day, honey. Two a day. One a day is that Kyle take one a day. He'll take like a whole handful because they taste so good. Anywho, I'm gonna go make my glow, eat my rice, which is probably cold because I've been talking. Okay, so I just painted my nails. I've been using the Nail Addict Polish. This is a gel polish, and I've been using the whole system. So they have a um, base, a top coat, and then they also have a remover. So there's like the whole system, and you do need a lamp um, to set the nail polish. Sorry, I'm going in and out of focus for some reason. Um, but I love it. It's like keeping my nails looking really, really nice and like polished and everything. No pun intended. But I just love it. They are so shiny and they honestly look professionally done. Um, they do start to peel up. But even when I got my gels professionally done, mine like always peeled up. Um, I kind of have like really small nail beds and they told me that the shape of my nails, um, it just tends to peel a little bit easier than other nails and like bigger nail beds, I guess. So... Anywho, I find that it lasts the same as a professional um, gel manicure. So the color I use today is Do Me A Favor and it's this like really pretty pink color. It's like almost the color of my skin, but like pinky. So I really like it. I need to go pack our diaper bag because I think we're gonna go over to my dad's for like a little cookout or something with the kids. So I need to pack up our diaper bag and then when we get home, I'm probably gonna do like a little workout later and shower and call it a night. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and comment down below if you guys have any video requests or ideas. I always write them down um, and save them for later. So yeah, let me know if you guys have any ideas. I love you so much and we'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.